In this video, you are going to see how to check your MacBook's battery health, when to replace it and some important tips to make your battery long last. Let's start step by step. Number 1. How to check battery health. For this, go to the Apple menu in the top left corner of your screen. Select system settings or system preferences then click on battery in the sidebar. Look for the battery health section to see the condition. Here you will see your battery health shown as a percentage. That's how you can quickly check your MacBook's battery condition. Now what happens if the battery health is at or below 80%? Number one, your battery can only hold 80% of the charge it could, meaning significantly less runtime on a full charge. Number two, Apple recommends replacement at this stage to maintain optimal performance and longer battery life. Now here comes the another question. When should you change your MacBook's battery? The right time is when the health drops below 80% of its original capacity according to me or whether you see a service recommended alert. Now to be clear, you can still use your MacBook even below 80%. There is no problem. Many people continue using it until 50% battery health by keeping it plugged in. There is nothing wrong with that but you will notice shorter battery life and reduced performance. That's it. For Apple's perspective, replacing the battery is advised for the best experience. Now here comes the another question. What are the warning signs that it's time for a replacement? Number one, your battery doesn't last as long as it's used to. Number two, your MacBook shuts down unexpectedly even when the battery seems charged. Number three, you notice sluggish performance or random shutdowns especially during heavy use. Number four, your MacBook only works when plugged in. If you are facing these, it's a clear sign that it's time to replace the battery. Now here are some of the tips to maintain the best MacBook battery health. Number one, keep the charge between 20% to 80%. Number two, use the built-in optimized battery charging feature in Mac OS system settings. Number three, Keep your Mac cool and updated. And number four, avoid extreme temperatures and don't leave it at 100% charging all the time. Not only that guys, even environmental factors also affect the battery life like the temperature, I mean the extreme heat or cold speeds of battery aging. Don't leave your MacBook in such conditions. And also even the brightness levels. Lowering your screen brightness to a comfortable level helps to conserve power when running on battery. If in case you are using your MacBook at outdoor conditions, it's obvious that you use at higher brightness levels, but make sure you are at least working in an optimal temperature range. If in case you are working at higher temperatures, then yes, your battery ages very fast. Before we end this video, there are some important notes. Number one, avoid using non-genuine Apple parts for replacement. They might affect safety and performance. Number two, always use an original Apple charger or a high quality trusted charger. And finally, remember this, don't expect that your battery will stay at 100% health forever. Nothing stays brand new once we start using it. Just like us, even batteries age with the time. Thanks a lot for watching this till the end. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do. Take care and see you again in the next video.